Hello everyone, it's Aikman. Today I'm playing on Mindblast, my own hosted server. So let's go ahead and jump in it real quick here. Hmm. Welcome Aikman to Mindblast and a lot of other stuff on the screen. Let's, okay, there it goes. So this is the spawn basically, got a little platform here, but in fact, it's a little island, or well, piece of the ground basically, flying island or something. I think it's really cool, um, and same for this one here, like that one more, I will add more, more leaves and water and stuff to that one later. Uh, and I got a little bridge here to connect them. So, this is the spawn. And this, hey, you can see it says swamp. Then it's an arrow down in the water here. Hmm, what could that be? Don't mind that because, well, don't mind it. Um, then we got this over here. The nether is in here. Mm -hmm. Really cool. And then we got this coming soon. Ooh. Wow, the fire is really loud. Coming soon. Desert. Mm -hmm. Then we got Iceland. And it's down there. So we're just going to jump in to the water here, dive in, get in, get out, and we are on a different place, load place. Wow. Well, it might lag on the recording now, but, well, whatever. So, this is the swamp biome, and we got some, some cool trees here, and, yeah, it's basically a PC ported, um, uh, ported a swamp map. So this is what it looks like. I cannot have the uh, the full render distance on because, um, yeah, well, because I'm recording and that my device is not as good as it was before, basically. Um, but this is sort of what it looks like. Can hello. Fly, okay. Ooh. Okay, this is going to be so bad on the recording, so I'm so sorry, guys. But yeah, you can see it's it's a map, a swamp map. And there are some caves here, I think. Yeah, they are around. Then, if, for example, you, let's say, you get stuck or that you get lost somewhere over here for example and you cannot find a way back to the teleport back to spawn then you do slash spawn and it will take you to the spawn of the uh, of the world you are at basically and on all the maps there are a a teleport back to looks like this most of them um, and if you step in look down you will get teleported back to spawn as you can see this is where we started this is where we went down so um, yeah right um, let's just get over here and go to the nether oh yeah right that's just a thing. I got a watch. What should I call it? A some kind of announcement thing that shows something every every X minutes. Yeah, it's just it's just basically just announcements and stuff. But here, nah, the Nether. I will have to cut here because it's going to lag so badly. Just because I'm recording. 
and I'm entering a totally new map so see you guys in a second okay so we are here everything has loaded pretty much but I'm not lagging at least and so this is the spawn at nether basically and you spawn here and if you somehow would get stuck whoops you would fall down here through the ground and then there is a sign here saying wow it's very very dark down here it's just because everything is loading and unloading and stuff there we go and you are currently stuck do slash spawn and then you will get teleported back up to here and there is a little water pit here because um, so you don't take damage basically so I'm just going to show you real quick here that this is yeah that this is a nether that looks like the PC version we got some the only thing is that we got some upside down we got some dinner bone trees down from our roof here it's strange but it's funny it's funny I like it um, but yeah it's it's really awesome I like this this nether actually whoops oh let's just so okay so well it's basically a nether if you have played the PC version then you know what it looks like uh, or what it could be like and as you can see this is a teleport back to back to spawn to the main spawn and here we are um, everything is unloading that's why it's dark and that's why everything is still here um, just so you know there's supposed to be a a jungle here but it's not because I had to delete the world because it didn't it, the level dot that file was it was messed up so I will have to fix another one basically so we have been in the swamp we have been in the nether um, and I deleted the jungle so we only got the Iceland left Iceland Whew, fancy and if you if you didn't notice here over here let's just run quickly as hell as you can see swamp it's a tree it's a pumpkin and we got some mushrooms and we got water okay that's that's pretty swampy isn't it then here jungle jungle trees and a pumpkin right then we got this little um, gravel path here um, Wow, it's very very dark there we go the light um, here nether currently it looks like sort of a nether right um, it's nether colorish ish right and this is going to look awesome when I'm done with the world and the desert yeah it's sandy <laughs> you see what I did there here uh, I don't really want to do that because it will melt the ice but it's a tree an ice tree and then we got just some frozen frozen little pot okay apparently we teleported to Iceland whoops so this is basically what it looks like when that renders it will look fantastic but here we got a a a snow temple no nah, that doesn't exist but this is basically a jungle and it's um, remade I suppose the uh, MC edit so it now it is a a a Iceland base an Iceland and geez um, so yeah we got some villages here this is the first village and then we got one over there if we can see it we can see that house and we can see the other ones over there 
right? Then we got these awesome trees. I love them. Why, you may ask? Well, look at it from a distance here. Looks like it could be clay, right? Clay. Very... Could be, right? Uh, but, in fact, it's actually snow. And ice. And that's... That's pretty cool, actually, how he did this. Um, so, I'm very happy for this world. And then, yeah, about this. If we put a block next to this, it will update and they will, well, they will break. It just, it used to be sand here. That's why. If you had that question, if not, if you could figure it out yourself, then you're cool. So, and then, and on these worlds, you can basically build your house, go mine, go chop down some trees, and do whatever you want. Um, almost. Don't grief the village, or that, or anything else. Don't grief, right, or steal. So, and as you can see, a teleport back to spawn. And, by the way, you will not be able to, to break uh, stuff too close to spawn. I will because I'm an admin, but reg regular people will not be able to. They will be able to do it out here, but not right under or up to sky level. So that is, I think that's pretty good if someone wants to or starts placing blocks here. It, w it would suck basically and then we got heat back to spawn use using working very very good so that is basically everything that that I've done and it's not it's not a little this has taken over over 14 hours I would say because it it's just insane. Um, all the plugins that I had to change a lot because where it didn't look good and unnecessary marks and so on. And then just that one took three hours to build. You, you may think I'm crazy when I'm saying three hours, but no, it literally took three hours. Because yeah, I had that there and that. Nah, I don't like that. So I wanted it to be perfect. And now it is. I think it's perfect. I like it. Actually, let's just do that, that, and that. Because we are on a good world. And yeah, by the way, what will happen if you are in survival mode? You will not be able to fly. And if you fall down, plumes. You're stuck. I guess you could swim up to that and then fall down again. So how do you do to get back up to spawn? Hint, hint. Hmm. Well, you type slash spawn and it will teleport you back to the spawn for the world that you are in. And this is the the spawn and then it will teleport you to the spawn of the spawn right that's pretty awesome isn't it how many times can you use spawn in a sentence <laughs> uh -huh. well that was everything for me thank you guys for walking walking <laughs> for watching <laughs> have a wonderful day take care bye bye see you later peace